The speaker industry is all in on voice activated speakers and JBL is no exception. The audio company now offers its Link series of Google Home powered speakers which are great value compared to the competition. Today we'll be looking at the Goldilocks of the JBL Link speaker line, the JBL Link 300, which retail for $250, 250 pounds, about 318 Australian dollars. This speaker is smaller than the top of the line Link 500 and larger than the portable Link 10 and Link 20 speakers. While not portable, the JBL Link 300 is an excellent alternative to the expensive Google Home Max, which retails for $400, around £300, $510 Australian dollars. While the JBL Link 300 won't give you audio feel sound, most people will enjoy its powerful bass response and warm sound. For its size, the Link 300 gets seriously loud and drops some serious space. It's not perfect but its flaws can be forgiven as it's a great value compared to the competition. The JBL Link 300 features an all-black exterior with JBL's signature cloth covering, which makes it look like a stretched-out portable Bluetooth speaker. Around the back is the Link 300's exposed woofer, which we wished were on the front so we could see it vibrate to our music and is more visually interesting than its austere black grille. If you're not a fan of the all-black color, you can get an all-white version instead. The JBL Link 300 gets very loud for its size and has no problem filling a room with sound. While not as powerful as its Link 500 sibling or the excellent sounding Google Home Max, the Link 300 kicks out some serious volume and bass. However, there is a bit of distortion at max volume. Speaking of bass, the JBL Link 300 definitely falls on the warm side of the audio spectrum, which means music features a bass and mid-bass bump with rolled-off highs. The speaker sounds best playing back hip-hop, electronic, pop, and dance music. Jazz, vocal and classical music lovers will want to check out the Sonos One or Apple HomePod instead.